Hey guys, it's me. Welcome to this. Here's the storm gameplay commentary. Today we're playing Diablo. Diablo is a warrior who has a lot of CC. Um, he can also do some decent damage with his lightning breath, heroic, or he can stun all enemy heroes after a very long delay. Uh, he's got a lot of uh, some utility. He had a lot of his damage took away from him though. Let's see what we do. Then. Choose a talent. Prepare for battle, mortals. Mm. Know this, demon. After this battle, I will destroy you. Ah, be no fear. <laughs> Very constructive, Diablo. I love this game. Uh, anyway, we have the Zebo Diablo, Kale, Sonia, and Abatha versus Vala, Sonia, Gazo, Zaratu, and Lovely. So, uh, level one, we will be taking block. Block is a talent which allows you to uh, block basic attacks basically every two seconds, I think. No. You can 50 certain mass damage off basic attacks and you can store two charges. I'm not sure how long it takes to re to um, redo it because I don't play this character at all. I don't like him. Am I supposed to be like three weight lanes again? And I'm dead. No, I'm not. Yes. Oh. I believe that interrupted is going to win. So uh, Diablo used to have a lot more damage from what I hear. Uh, but they removed some of it and give him I don't know what they did. I honestly don't care. So I have no idea what they did to Diablo. I just know they changed him. And he had most of his damage took away. We got some of them. Some of them. Um, yeah. Okay, just gotta kill Sonia. Uh, at this level. We're gonna take Soul Catcher so that we passively will generate souls without needing to do stuff. Let's kill. So, yeah, so I should really go over my ability, shouldn't I? Um. So. Um. My passive is called Blood Black Soul Stone. This will give me extra health, depending on how many souls I have stored. It should give me and at a hundred souls. If I die at a hundred souls, I'll be resurrected, but I lose all of my souls. That's not good. So we don't want to die and we just died and we didn't have a hundred souls so we didn't lose our souls this is a really really weird ability I'm curious for shadow charge we will charge and knock people back 
Oops. Our W is called Flame Stomp. It's a big stomp around us doing damage. Our E is called Overpower. This is a little tiniest of areas around us, and we basically throw people over our shoulder. Uh, so, yeah. Can't use it on bosses. Can't do this stuff. So, if I die now, I will be restored at health. At, at health. At base. Uh, that was a bad death. I'll be rest at base after 5 seconds, I think. That was not a good time to die, because I just lost all my health. There is n this is not good to die as this character. At level, at this level, we're going to be taking... I don't know. I have no idea. Who wants to capture this mercenary camp? Because we died, I'm going to take soul steel, so we get more survivability. My logic is, if I have more survivability, I won't die and lose all my souls as much. That's my logic, at least. I'm stuck into it. Keep up the fight. So yeah, this is the Merlock skin. You got it if you bought the beta, basically. It's the only reason I own this thing. Just, just go on, t trap your tank in the big zombie. This was a, like a master when I remember seeing the master icon. Uh, we could probably kill him. Can we? Hmm. That is a good point. I should. So yeah, our health will gradually increase over time because of our soul capture talent. And it will increase even more because of soul steel, so... That's good. We'll become more survivable and hopefully we won't need to use the resurrect as much. Because I really don't want to have it. Uh, what jolt did that? I mean, he took the, the, the ravenous spirit, so... By my logic, that means we take... Uh, apocalypse. So, I'm probably dead. I really kind of do want lightning breath, though. Uh, I suppose let's just go for the apocalypse. Oh, this is not good. This is really bad. Whoa! I took so much damage there. It's like I went from max health to dead in literally about five seconds. That's really dumb. And what sucks more is that we don't we get the benefit of soul catch when we're dead, so that's not good. I don't want to play more Diablo. This is I really don't like this character. <laughs> We should head to a healing fountain quickly. We'll also reveal our enemies, our ult, our um, apocalypse. I'm only taking apocalypse, by the way, considering they have an Azebo who took Ravenous Spirit. Otherwise, I would basically always take the other ultimate, our uh, lightning. Speaking of Ravenous Spirit, we can just do that. We didn't even need to use our ultimate. Now we'll use our ult. 
ist ein Wiesen. I don't like the idea of any of these talents. Spell shield's our best option, I suppose, because they do have an Azibo. So that could... I don't know. As I said, don't take any of the info I give you in the Diablo video. Maybe the talent bill might be okay, if for certain circumstances. I have no idea. Yeah, there's nothing I can do. I just melt as well as our the rest of our team. Activate it now! The heavens will fall before us. I am kind of convinced that the other ult would have been a better choice, honestly. But there's one as evil. We can interrupt him from halfway across the map, so I think that is still very worth it. Other than just doing, ooh, I can refire on you and do a ton of damage. Oh wait, you can do the same thing. Just with a ravenous spirit that you can control a lot easier. It doesn't sound like a good choice to me. And Phoenix, I suppose, for the win. Just in case. Let's take this. So we will knock away the Serator. And that is a Void Prism. Whoa, they got it! How? They're just gonna blink. There's no point in taking this ult, I don't think. It's. I don't. There is actually. It's very good. I don't know how to use it. And that was done now. And I'm not even gonna rest. We were two souls away from getting an instant res. At level 16, we will be taking Domination. This reduces the cooldown of our E ability by 10 seconds. This has a 2 second cooldown. I am not kidding you. My, this is laggy. This should have a 2 second cooldown. This is bugged. Yeah, this is bugged. Oh, it reduces the cooldown of your Q by It reduces the cooldown of your Q by 10 seconds. This means this has... Okay, I misread it. This has a 2 second cooldown as long as we use this before we shadow charge. It's pretty good. I'm not convinced anymore, but sounds good. So that she means we can do this. Oh man, that's really good. Body bot like a lot. And this is lag. Yeah, that's really good. That is a lot of um <laughs> That's a lot of control. Uh, I'm pretty sure that was a good ult I did as well, just to... What on earth are you talking about, Diablo? Here's Mergle Gurgle. 
That was them. <laughs> That's good. The amount of displacement is really good. I didn't want to detonate that. Oh well. <laughs> this is actually a really good talent. I didn't know. Um, yeah, people should take it. It's really good. Interrupt the ravenous spirits so we can get out to kind of when it helps. At level twenty. I have no idea what I'm gonna take. Um I think I'm gonna go for. Mm, I don't want Bolt of Storm, actually. And if I had Lightning Breath, I'd take Bolt of Storm. I'm gonna go for. Okay, at level 20, we're gonna take Lord of Terror. This is blood for blood for Diablo. AoE blood for blood, basically. Use it there. I'll give that as a kill. <laughs> that is really fun. <laughs> that is really fun to do. I suggest we take this mercenary camp. And that gives a lot of damage as well. I mean, that is just so much damage. I didn't even know about this talent until I saw it on a, vid on a video the other day. the shrine. So every mercenary camp on the team belongs to on the map, sorry, belongs to us. It's very good. I'm gonna let my team activate it. No, I wish this Nazebo would stop trapping me in zombie walls. Not my Nazebo, they uh, not our their Nazebo, our Nazebo. No, he did it. Again. No, that was the only one. Out. Wow, they didn't get any and we got all of them. So let's so uh, use our AOE buff blood and ult. So we, I think we managed to interrupt the Z bolt with that. Good. You, acceptable combat buff. 
performance. Let's head back. We need to get some health. I do have a res, but I don't want to use it yet. She's just gone. It's okay. We're still winning. Oh, this is a lot of mice. This could be really nasty. If anyone on the enemy team walks into that, they're going to get one shot. <laughs> Sonya just ults a camp. It's fine. It's the Wrath of the Berserker, so she can actually do that. Okay. Blood for blood. An ulti. Stun the enemy Sonya, and then we get a kill. And we died, but we didn't, because we're going to rest. Okay, and that's team wipe, and that should be victory. Yeah, this is GG. We definitely win that. There's no way we can't, I think. As long as we all group up and push the ball. So, apparently there used to be a combo which you could do on Diablo, but they fixed it so it didn't happen. And you could and you could one-shot someone. Uh, basically, you would hit them with every wave of the W, and they'd be one-shot with 2k damage, so... That would be so fun. This was actually a pretty good game. I don't like Diablo, but I could certainly see me play more of him in the future. That was pretty fun. Let's get some stats. Takedowns. No one really cares. Why am I showing them? I got third. It's pretty good. Deaths. More good. It's seven deaths. I mean not that bad. Kale got 12, but still, not that good. We had Mammies, Gazlo, and Nazeba, and Zeratul. We had the second lowest siege damage after Zeratul. That's not a big surprise. Hero damage, is, we had the lowest in the game. I'm really surprised that... Wow, Kale did so little damage. He had third lowest somehow. Let's check his build after this. Roll. We did the most tanking, which is what we're supposed to do, so I'm happy. An XP contribution. It's alright. I almost did the, as much as the most XP contributor. I don't know. It's not that good. And for talents, we took block because they had some mixed attack dealing characters. Uh, we took soul catcher so that we got more souls. Soul, ste soul steal so that we have more HP. Apocalypse because we wanted to counter the Zebo ravaging spirit thing. Spell shield because I didn't see anything better to take. Uh, domination domination because I wanted to try it out and apparently it's really really good. Let me take the Lord of Terror at level 20. Level 13 was there anything better? Could take Siphon the Dead, I suppose, but mm, I'm not sure. Anyway, thank you for watching this video, and goodbye.